Well, homecoming celebrations look different this year because of the pandemic, but that is not stopping people from showing their school spirit. Kettle Vance Kelly Volk shows you how one university is getting creative during its special week. The pandemic may have canceled Dakota Wesleyan University's homecoming parade this year. I'm sad that there's no parade, 100%. But there's no pumping the brakes on Tiger Pride. Me and my friends have come and taken a couple pictures with it. Dakota Wesleyan sophomore Darby Deffenbaugh is a student ambassador and she belongs to Future Teachers Organization. Two of several groups that put up displays on campus for blue and white days. It's called a spirit cruise. You'll find students' creations set up along the campus loop. You can walk the route or take a ride in your car. Senior Edgar Meza and other members of the Conservation Club brought some scarecrows to campus with their display. A lot of people went like above and beyond on the decorations and uh, the really eye appealing and yeah, it kind of gives you a little background of you know, all the different clubs that you can find here on campus. What I appreciate a lot about our students and our group that put this together is they approached it from saying, what's an opportunity to do this differently? And they came up with a great strategy for that, and I think it reflects the spirit of this institution. A spirit that helps cruise ahead through challenging times. I would just say that I think we're so lucky to be able to do this. I'm thankful that we're still able to um, get together in a unique way and um, just kind of show our support and our love for Dakota Wesleyan. With Positively Kelloland, I'm Kelly Volk. Go tag. Click the link in the story for a look at the Spirit Cruise route. <laughs>